Hi everyone, not sure if this is going to go very well or not. I've uh, just pulled the packaging off the outside of the box of shadows. I'm going to try to uh, hopefully get a decent picture. I'm going to try to, I'm going to have to hold this while I'm doing it, hold the camera, so it may be a little jerky. Of course, I'm a little jerky too. Uh, but I'm going to open this box of shadows first, and then I'm going to open a print that I got from Mitten 3, which I'm sure will blow everyone away. All right, this box that I'm opening is the Initiate box. It's the least expensive one. It cost about 20 Bucks somewhere in there to have it shipped to me. So here I go. I'm going to unbox it. It's got tissue covering everything. And inside, first off, there's a list of contents. And it says I have one bundle of undressed chime candles, <coughs> a smudge stick, incense of the month is cinnamon, herb of the month is mugwort, one Samhain votive candle by Modern Magics, and one potent bath or powder bath bomb. And one white silicone, I can't say it, selenite wand. So let me see what we got here. Well, first off, we have the bath bomb. I like the way it looks. The packaging's nice. Uh, nice and big. It ought to be kind of cool. All right, let's see what else we got. Oh, we have a beautiful Samhain candle. From Modern Magics. It tells you, uh, on the back of it, it tells you all about it. Uh, it's got like rosemary, nettle, clove, allspice, and mugwort in it. If you look at the top of the candle, you can see the, the dry spices on the top. Or dry herbs on the top. Spices, what am I talking about? Okay, next we have... As soon as I can set this down and it doesn't try to run away on me. I have a box of cinnamon incense sticks, incense cones. I love the smell of cinnamon, so that's cool. Very, very cool. Hi, Angela. Hi, Christy. Violet. And I've seen some other folks in here earlier. Uh, I have a bag of mugwort. One ounce. It's quite a bit. Let's see here. Ooh, wrapped up in the paper. What is it? What is it? What is it? I'm impatient like a little kid. Feels like a lollipop. What is it? It is... Oh. A great looking smudge stick. One day I'll do a, uh, I'll do a uh, film or video about smudging and how it works and how to do it for yourself. Very cool one. This is this one will probably last a good half hour to an hour, I imagine. Really cool. 
I'm living in Wyoming. It's kind of weird to, to enjoy something that comes to you that's made of sage. Because everything's made of sage out here. Oh, also there's this card. Your uh, order was mindfully packaged using eco-friendly materials in our ongoing effort to support sustainability. Earth-friendly packaging. Very cool. I like that. You don't see that all the time. I think they could have added that to the contents page and been a little more earth-friendly by not sending anything in that at all. Uh, there's a card for Modern Magics to get those candles. Uh, Modern Magics with an X at the end at gmail.com or modernmagics.storeenv.com Very cool. Probably have to check them out. When I turn this over to a YouTube video, I will post the uh, I will post the information there. This this is like Christmas, I'm telling you, I'm enjoying this. They keep putting everything in these little bundles of tissue paper. Woo! Let me get rid of that now. Oh, I got a nice selection of candles here. We got white, orange, yellow. Kind of a gray and green. The things you got to remember about candles, though, is you have to dress them properly because we don't want these naked candles to be out there. It is kind of like Christmas, Angela. Thank you for saying that. Now, I am looking for, and I don't see it in here, the selenite wand. I've got the candles, the smudge stick, the incense, the herb, the votive candle, the bath bomb. But somewhere in there is supposed to still be the selenite wand. Let's see if I can find it. Mixed in all the tissue. And yes, there it is. Hidden well. I'll show you what that looks like since I get it unwrapped. I read some reviews on this company before I bought from them. And they seem like a, a really, really well-white company. So, oh, this is beautiful. It's long, it's, it's long and hard, mm. it's beautiful. Uh, I'm sure I'll be able to use this a lot. Really happy. Yeah, it is pretty, it is pretty good. One. Oh, I'm going to love this stuff. Okay, so I got the wand. The candles, mugwort, an ounce of mugwort, a box of cinnamon spice incense, a great, great sage, white sage, uh, smudge stick, and A body bomb, or a bath bomb. That's quite cool. And it was, uh, I want to say this was $19.99. Uh, when, when you had shipping, it was like $24. Uh, I went ahead and canceled because I wasn't sure I was going to like it. But I'm kind of liking it, so, you know. But that's something i got to have to look into my finances to see if I can still afford but here's the, oh, I forgot this too. This is that beautiful uh, 
Salon candle made by Modern Magics. And see the beautiful, see all the herbs on the top of it. That's going to burn so well. It smells so good. Cannot wait. Use that on salad. All right, now I'm going to move on. Set this to the side. Put the little card in there. Not even going to try to put all that tissue paper back together. Close my box of shadows. And once again, guys. That's the box of shadows, and that's the initiative, initiate uh, version. It has three different versions. This is the least expensive, and it goes up to uh, initiative. It is up with the supreme. I can't remember what the other one in between is. No open flame with my oxygen, no. I don't wear it all the time. I just... Uh, I've been out today, I had to go uh, see a new doctor today, and then we had to go to the hospital so I could uh, get my uh, me medical records ordered up, and uh, we're going to move on from there. It's a bad story, I'll, I'll share it one day. Uh, basically it cost me about six months of my life that I... So I'm, on, I'm kind of like we're to the point where it's going to be probably six more months before I can have my weight loss surgery because a doctor screwed up. Okay, uh, next I want to move on to a great piece that I picked, I picked up on a, a sale the other day from my, my friend Minton, uh, who does uh, one of my favorite artists in the world. It's this comes from Minton Three Studios, and I love his work. And uh, I have to get a special spot set up just to display the work. Right now, I got all this ugly art on the wall that I made, and I want to uh, get some of this professional stuff on the wall. Cut the cut the tape. His assistant's name is Christy. And she does such a great job of packaging these things. Uh, real soon I'll be getting the Salem book uh, that they did a Kickstarter for that I, that I helped with by purchasing. And, uh, oh my, my. This is beautiful. Let me get through this tape. Christy's really got it put in there well. <laughs> this is a piece that I purchased uh, that Minton did a collaboration making this piece with a great photographer. And I'm not sure she even realizes how great she is. Her name is Louise Frank. And she's from England. She is the partner of one of the collaborators with Minton on his uh, Ars Memoria. Ars Memoria uh, Gallery in Chicago, Illinois. And I want you to see this. Hopefully you'll be able to get a good idea what it looks like. It's still in the, it's still in the wrapping, but man, it is beautiful. Hope you can see this well. Let me back up a little bit more. My window may be screwing with us too. I'm gonna flip the camera around from my. And then I can pull this out a little more. And what you're seeing is the wrinkles of the plastic that's over it. But this is a beautiful piece. And this lady here is actually Louise, I believe. She does some wonderful work. And I will, when I turn this over to uh, YouTube, 
I will post the link back to back to Facebook for it, and it, and I'm planning on putting all the links of the different uh, the different uh, sites and things that are mentioned in this video. But uh, Benton puts up these. Uh, he has art. has print sales every now and then, and he has. Uh, they also do a Magic Revolution, and I'm expecting a T-shirt any day from uh, from them. And the T-shirt I got, it's got a skull on it. And it was made by uh, David Stupakis, who's another wonderful artist that's part of this art collaboration called The Hand at Mittens Inn. And the other artist that assisted with that is, is Damien Eccles. And if you uh, know who Damien Eccles was, he's part of the West Memphis Three uh, group that got too long ago for being wrongly accused for killing three boys. Uh, it was a big deal when it happened. Uh, but yeah, I will sh be showing a lot of these art prints and things. I'll be getting a print a month from Dim from uh, Minton soon because I I joined his Patreon page. Uh, with, as far as David Sapakis, I've got a couple of prints of his. I just uh, during the changeover of the house and and the moving things around, I'm not exactly sure where they're at right now. I will find them and get them put on here at some point. I got to find some suitable framing and uh, things like that for the pictures and get them up. But yeah, this one with Louise is wonderful and beautiful, and uh, Minton, you can, Minton has actually got his signature on there, and uh, what a wonderful collaboration. Okay guys, I'm going to stop bending your ear and say thanks for watching my video, and hopefully uh, I can do more things like this. I'm planning on showing some more stuff as I work along building the castle, and uh, work along with my paintings and whatnot. Uh, I don't know if this is interesting to you or not. If it is, let me know. If not, that's fine too. Uh, I just won't take the time to do it. All right, thanks guys for uh, putting up with me. And Violet, you have a beautiful day, and... Much energy and love to you and your family and friends. Angela, also, love you. Take care of yourself. We'll talk to you soon.